But who tailors sweatpants? Who Ooh, tailors I never sweatpants? Tailor sweatpants. I never tailor so you're sweatpants. You're gonna get them cropped. Never on everything I look. So you're gonna get cropped. Sweatpants? Never. T I tailor my jeans. I tailor my trousers. Never tailor sweatpants in my life. I promise you. Yo, I pro oh. what sweatpants? What sweatpants? The Adidas. No. Yo, the, you know what's funny? I'll show you the Adidas ones right now. I folded them in. I promise you, Christopher. <laughs> I folded them in. He's I'm trailer. telling you. He tailored I them. In. I did not. Look, the only reason he doesn't tailor his underwear is because no one sees it. I, look, I will say this. All right, all right, world, <laughs> YouTube world, podcast world, universe. We, the universe. We're gonna keep it PG. The events. It's gonna but be hard. It's gonna be hard. I don't, I don't cuss, but you cuss. It's yeah, I cuss like it's, a sailor, man. But it should, it should be natural. Yeah, you're right. You're right. The one rule here is that we're gonna be us. You're right. You're right. All right. So fuck that shit, man. <laughs> we gonna fucking curse this motherfucker, man. Fuck all that. Just all right, go, man. If you're a church, don't follow us. Everybody Yo, else follow support. us. Give me the view. Give me the. You know what I'm saying? Yo, bro. bro. So we live, man. Bro, we live. That's dope. Uh, That's dope. So this is our podcast slash video slash YouTube slash whatever else allows us to grow. Amen. And oh, uh, Jesus in there. Amen. And so Jesus in there. You know, we're gonna have church with this mic. <laughs> Uh, and it's called, what is it called? I'm down. And yeah, why I'm is it I'm down? Because, first of all, look, you know why it's called I'm down? Before we get to like the real, I feel like that's a word that we use all the time, right? So like, we'll be at the movies, right? So literally, we'll go to the movies right now, right? And next thing you know... Spoiler, Avengers is great. <laughs> but that's not a spoiler, friend. that's a horrible spoiler. <laughs> By the time y'all watch it, y'all should have watched Avengers, by the way, so... We're gonna have some... Nah, we're not gonna have no eggs in here. No spoilers in here, because I haven't watched it yet, so hold up. Let me get back on topic. I found so, so, can, I, can I give one spoiler? No? One. Is it big? It's, a, it's huge. Nah, nah, what the hell? Oh. No, we want to watch it in like a couple hours. No, no, no. No, <laughs> no, 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 no. So get back to the serious stuff. Yeah. Why is it up that? So, because we could be doing literally anything, right? Go to the movies, whatever. And, and I feel like anything that either one of us say is never off limits. If you really think about it, it's almost like, yo, let's go, let's, shut the fuck up. <laughs> it's like, yo, let's go, I don't know, bro, let's go to an ice skating rink or something like that. I feel like Chris was just say, all right, man, whatever, I'm down, I'm with it. Just I, like, I, uh, I, I mean, the, the thing is that we have that kind of temper, which is like, yo, if it's a new opportunity, a new adventure, why not? And at the same time, there's certain things we do like, so we're always going to be down for it. Like, yeah. We're always down for the movies. Exactly, literally. Literally. Bro, literally. how many crappy movies have we seen just to go see a movie? Yo, put it like this. We've gone to the movies pretty much, I think like, like except for last week that I went on a trip. But besides that, we've been going to the movies for like the past month, I think, or something like that. Like back to back, back weekends, back to back weekends. Just watching like... The people know us now. Like, <laughs> yeah, the people literally, they like, oh, it's you guys. <laughs> come on, man, come on. Don't show me no ID. So, yeah, it's crazy. But the idea yeah. of I'm down is, is, you know, we always have that opportunity of new things. So when George came up with, yo, we should do this podcast, let's get it started, no more excuses, my response was the same one as always. Yes, yes. And you know, so this is an interesting thing about that. So I remember probably like three weeks ago or something like that, we were at, at a restaurant here in Miami called Brimstone and... So we're eating food and I'm talking to, to hey, Fatima. Hey, you should give us free stuff. We're advertising you guys. You should, you should. I saw, I, me and Fatima were having a conversation and I think I brought up the word podcast. So for a while, I was thinking about, yeah, I want to start a podcast and specifically with Chris. That's the funny part. So I did not bring this up to Chris at all. <laughs> I did not bring this up to Chris at all, at all. So while we're, while we're having lunch, waiting to go to a movie, ironically, just say like that, yes, make me feel good. <laughs> <laughs> make you feel pretty. Yes, please. <laughs> Chris goes, yo, we should do a podcast. And that, like, I interrupt the conversation I had with Fatima. I was like, yo, just that like you told me that I've been thinking about that, blah, blah. You know, like, we just like, it's like a connection right there. You know, like, it's connection. Like when you look at each other, you say, you make love with none of this. <laughs> 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 you took that one too far. That was too far. I don't know. Uh, just kidding, guys. Just kidding. Yeah, man. Kidding. So the idea just came about. So then, like, I think, you know, we kind of left it at that. And, you know, we've been talking lately a lot about not just goals, but, like, just more practicality, right? Like, what's practical? Because, right, right. you know, like, you can listen to any, like, motivational speaker, and they motivate you, you know? Like, they make you feel good, but you're, like, on a high for 24 hours, 36 hours. But then, you know, you start to slowly progress down, right? So, we're really been talking a lot about what's practical. What, what can we do that we can start now that's initiated now? You get me? So, this is definitely one of the platforms that is probably easiest to start because this... 
this literally so we left it at that that day at the restaurant we haven't talked about it for probably like a week or so and then i told chris right on the week that we're going yeah, to the yeah. trip which last week i like yo not this weekend, but next weekend we're starting the podcast. No questions asked. No questions asked. He's like, yo, I'm with it. I'm down. <laughs> always. That's Literally. always going to get a response. Yes. So we came back from the trip. Probably like from like the span of Tuesday to basically like Thursday, we ordered the mics. Like we're talking about the mics. Yeah, you check know. reviews, yeah. preparing stuff, seeing what equipment we need. Exactly. Like you're coming up with the design yeah, of like yeah. the the background. No, what is it? The, 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 the logo. The logo. Of the, the logo. Well, we need one for yeah. the podcast. Yeah. Right, for the podcast and sure. for YouTube. You yeah. know, a little circle yeah. thing on YouTube. Icon but, or whatever you call yeah, it. Yeah, exactly. I so, I mean, so it really just got, this basically happened like, like, like this. You get me? Which is like. Hey, we're just talking about what we're gonna talk about, and this is perfect right now. This this just leads me to talk about just doing. You get me? Because it's yeah, that's a good point. Yeah, because I I feel like you know. But, we live, but hold up, you're not wearing Nike. First of all, I got a lot of Nike, bro. Don't try me, bro. I'll take that yeah, Nike. Nike is free stuff. First of all, everybody's gonna be free stuff. Let me tell you something, bro. All my workout gear is Nike. Is Socks, boxes. Video? It should be. Look, it would be though. Though, like, I can have like the whole Nike fit here. Yeah, like, all the time. Nike cow, just do it. Yo, Nike, hit me up, bro. We started. Yeah, like, like, look at my briefs. Right, right. <laughs> but, but um, yeah, yeah. So, but that's not. I mean, like, look, we live, we live in a world where a lot of us we want to do a lot of things. You get me? All the time. All the time, right? We want to start this. We want to do that. And the thing is that we don't, we do too much contemplating, too much thinking, and we don't do enough action. Oh, definitely. Right? And, and the thing is, we're, we're passionate about a lot of things, but we're not dedicated about anything. Mm-hmm. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, you know, like, Very true. I've started the gym so many times. And gave up. Hit <laughs> me up three weeks later. I'm in a fight you can't yeah, get I like, yo, bro, I can't, bro. <laughs> it's, yes, it's, yes. It's because, you know, we, we don't, especially young people, we, yeah. we have no perseverance. At all. And no patience. At all. That, yo, that is a biggest, no patience, yo, millennials are known for no patience, for sure. If it don't got a paycheck attached to it, best believe a millennial, first of millennial, all, millennial that's what no, doing. First of all, you still already cut it up for the 15th and the 30th. Yes. And you just got paid. Yes. You're like, when did I get paid again? You already going to work and it's, you want to get paid. We're so reckless, bro. Yeah, I thought about that. Like, how reckless? Like, we been wanting to get paid for but everything. But you know what the problem is? Is that we got spoiled. Yes. We got Wi-Fi. Yes. And if your Wi-Fi is taking too long yes. and your Netflix is in load. Right? Yo, you know what's funny? I was watching this video and this guy was saying, this guy, Gary Vee, so most of you might know Gary Vee. He was saying, we live in a in a society where people are complaining for stupid shit. You're complaining because you got the wrong kind of milk. Well, in your case, that matters. First of all. In your case, that matters. But in, <laughs> not everybody's lactose intolerant, right? So, 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 so many people are complaining for stupid shit, right? Like, oh, I got too much whipped cream in my coffee, or I got, like, you know, little no, stuff. No, no, but, but honestly, honestly, honestly. There's a point in there. I'm gonna defend you because think about it. You are, or first of all, we all overpay for these things, right? There's no well, way you should be paying seven dollars for a coffee, but I'm willing to do it no matter what. <laughs> but if so, I'm gonna pay seven dollars for a coffee that uh, a girl like Vicky Baker would give it to me for one dollar fifty cents, mm -hmm. you know, I'm gonna, I gotta get what I ordered, the right thing. I mean, right. So to that point, yeah, you do have. A, okay, so you make a good point there. At the same time, I want to look at the the more realistic part of that coin, right? Which is okay. So, as far as, well, not to get too deep into coffee, right? <laughs> That's what I'm getting at. Not to get too deep into coffee. You open the blinds up a little bit because the dimming in here is getting a little bit of... There you yeah, go. Yeah, that might be, that might be a little bit. Yeah, good. You, might, you might look a little pale there. Like yeah, Edward from, uh, from the... I think I said Squidward. I was like, dang, bro. Well, Edward, bro, from the <laughs> Vampire Diaries. There you go. Twilight. Twilight. From the Vampire Diaries? Whatever that thing is called. I don't know what it is, but it sounds wrong. And, well, whatever. But it's a backtrack, right? But the point is, you you have a good point there. But to see like the other side of that coin is is just to not necessarily put the specifics into coffee, just the specifics into the complaining. Okay, you know I mean? yeah, yeah, just yeah. period, right? Because yeah. initially, you're absolutely right. Like, we definitely are spoiled. And if and if you look, anybody starting a business or anything like that at the same time, before like 2008, like after 2008. You're spoiled too. Oh, yeah. Because you've yeah, been yeah. seeing nothing but yeah. prosperity from well, that point on. You get me? As far as business goes, well, remember, if you're in the right market. Yeah, <laughs> right, 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 right. Because, you know, like the whole housing market, when the whole housing market crashed, it literally affected the economy. Oh, period, of course, right? Of course. So, you know, the since then, look, since then, stock wise, stuff like that, the market's done like, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, you, but so, that's because it had to bounce back. And obviously, yeah. let's not forget that the government in, influenced like, a lot. Right, right, a lot. right, right. So that was the bounce back there. For sure. But uh, I understand what you're saying in the sense of we're spoiled because I, I always say that I complain about everything. You know, When things are too good, I complain. 
Because I worry that something bad has to happen. So you're already yeah, like, you're already like, like the trip yeah, yeah, yeah. So you're like, hold up, hold up. This food was great. Yeah. Are you sure my milk was there? Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Are you like, you think it's too good? All the milk doesn't taste that good. You know? Like, oh, but, man. But, but divas, divas, bro, divas. <laughs> oh, don't nah, let me get started. Don't let me get started. I'm not gonna lie. Don't I me. definitely fall into that bracket for sure. I <laughs> no, am you, a master you, complainer. You don't fall into that bracket. You are the bracket. <laughs> yeah, I'm fine. Like, I'll admit, I'm definitely a huge diva, especially. So, when it comes to certain things, though. But for sure, I'm definitely the biggest diva. No, I'm not the biggest diva. Not certain things. Everything. Name everything. one thing. Name one thing. Only one. Yeah, name one thing I'm a diva. Okay, all right. So, this is the, I, I love my tailor, right? He, he has the same tailor. This dude is amazing, great work ethic, great guy overall. But who tailors sweatpants? <laughs> who tailors I never sweatpants? tailor sweatpants. I never tailor so sweatpants. Gonna, you didn't get them cropped. Never, on everything I look. So you're gonna go sweatpants? Never to ta I tailor my jeans, I tailor my trousers, never tailor sweatpants in my life, I promise you. Yo I pro oh, what sweatpants? What sweatpants? The Adidas? No Yo, the, you know what's funny? I'll show the Adidas ones right now. I folded them in. I promise you, Christopher, <laughs> I folded them in. You I'm tailored, telling you, you tailored I them. them. I did not. Look, the only reason he doesn't tailor his underwear is because no one sees it. I look <laughs> I will say this though. Once you get to tailoring, oh, you no, no, become no, no. addicted. Oh, 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 yeah. You yeah. become addicted. No, no, you, you become picky. Yes. Nothing fits anymore. Yes. You become a look. I went through. A, I want to say a period where I just tailored everything. Like yo, every dress shirt tailored, every shirt tailored, everything tailored. <laughs> yo, except for sweatpants. I tailored the sweatpants. Again, this is my hashtag. Hashtag. I do not stand behind these allegations. <laughs> You're worse than OJ Simpson. Like he, he got it's caught the in the video. It's yeah, that the wasn't truth. me. That wasn't me. It wasn't. I promise you, I've never tailored my sweatpants. All right, Mister Clinton. But but to get to your to your point, yes, yeah, we're absolutely spoiled in this place. I actually almost lost the topic in my mind right now. What were you talking about? <laughs> yeah, it's talking right? about the fact that we're ungrateful. We have no patience. We don't dedicate ourselves. Exactly. So look, I think I think it's an important thing right now to to really think about, right? So if you really think about it, um. You need to deploy patience, period. Because either way, like with this, I don't, I don't expect for this to blow up tomorrow, a week from now, a year from now. I expect for this to be a struggle for the both of us. Oh yeah, you get but, me? but I, as then I think, uh, and I think this is the key to to going through your struggle is you gotta understand that there's value in it. You know, uh, it says that well, for me, I'm, I'm a Bible guy, right? Like yeah. for me, I, I believe what the Bible says, and it says that you know your struggle develops in you perseverance. It develops in you gratitude, it develops in you all these things because you understand that, you know, the process was worth it. Right, right. You wouldn't be the sure. same if you didn't go through your struggles, right, in your life or in stuff. So, but also, I think the beauty of podcast for us is, this is something we love to do anyways. We love to talk about anything and everything. Mm -hmm. So, it's like, it's not like we're being forced to do this. We, we want to do it and perhaps it brings value to somebody else, you know, and we would love to bring value to other people, right? For we sure. want to impact people. Yeah, for sure. So, I think that's the whole idea of I'm down. The whole movement is, you know, we're always down to to create new ideas, new experiences, to communicate. Conversation is necessary Amen. in every aspect of our lives, you know, whether you, you're political, religious, whether you're social or whatever, you know, you need communication, you need conversation. It opens our eyes to see how people see the world. Absolutely. absolutely. And it allows us to, you know, not forget that not everyone sees or comes from where we come from. Yeah, yeah. Right? So, but I think back to the point you were saying is, is you know, we got to need to endure, but we got to find the point of why we're doing things. That is what, if we focus on the point all the time, then we might actually finish. You know, we yeah. might actually get to the end. Yeah, gotcha. We yeah, need, but, we need, but at the same time, you always say, I think you always tell me this, is you need practical goals. For sure. You know, if you can't visualize yourself doing something and why you're doing it and when you know you succeeded, then there's going to be a point where you're like, why am I wasting my time? Yes, yes, very true, very true. You know, that, and that, and that, that's the thing. Either way, like, everything has to kind of come together as you're doing something like right, that. Because right. you can't, you can't just be practical and not patient. No, you get oh, me. Oh, that, that's deep. Yes, Ooh. for sure. Oh, that's deep. Right. So the the thing is because a lot of people, especially like look, coming back to the sport and stuff like that. Look, we come from where your mom, your dad's telling you, oh, you know, you're special. Like, look, let me put this into perspective for you right now, right? 
So the chances of you becoming a human being, just in general, right? Like based on science and everything, yeah. right? It's what, one in a trillion? One in four trillion, actually. It's one in four trillion of you, right? So that means that you're the, the sperm that one. Exactly, you're the sperm that <laughs> one. It could have been a possibility that homeboy would have bumped you out of the way <laughs> and you will not be here right Imagine now. Imagine that. You're just like screaming. Yes, it. yes. So if you think about it, there's a bunch of dead human beings out in some type of like <laughs> virtual reality. I know it was supposed to be deep, but that was the worst analogy ever. <laughs> Listen. Is the truth though? <laughs> You're like, hey, truth. watch out! I'm coming out! Yes, I'm coming out! Like you're fucking somebody. It's the truth. You need to realize the opportunity you have. You know I mean, the right. fact that you're a human that's, being. That's period. True. The period. That's already like more than enough. You know what I mean? And to add on top of that, especially like now, living now. You know what I mean? Like you have technology at your fingertips. Like oh, yeah. literally. You know what I mean? Like the things so that much. you can. Like yo, what we're doing here is what people have to like. Yo, people have to bust their butts just to like get on radio back then. Yeah, I mean, well, I, I, and the thing is, like, the whole idea of podcast is crazy. Yes. Or, or like, you know, streaming or, or YouTube. Mm -hmm. You know, like, it's like, it, it's something that it, it's a window of opportunity for anybody. You know, absolutely, absolutely. like you always say, if you have if you have something that you believe is valuable, then you no, know, you can share it with the world, yeah. right? And, and I think that idea of you already said it. Getting on radio was super. Hard. Even to this day, getting music played on radio, you gotta pay a lot of money. People forget I've gone through. So, you know, make your life count. And, and so, the idea of I'm down is an idea of, it's kind of like, you know, see the movie Yes Man? Yeah. You know, he's like, he's like, yes. And then there's also uh, another thing I love is um, when they do acting, um, what's that, what's that kind of acting? The one I like that we go to theater? Oh, improvising. Improvising. So, improvising has one thing that is, is yes and, yes and. Yeah. Right? So, you say yes and you add to it. Gotcha. Got right? So, yeah, I, like, uh, so, it's like, you know, you keep yeah, going. Yeah, yeah. So, it's never a hold up, stop. It's a, okay, yes. But I don't like where you're going, so I'm going to add end to it. Yes. You get me? And so that's how we want to be. We want to be like, yes, I'm down, but, or end. Yes, you yes, know? yes, definitely. You know, that, and that's a very powerful thing. Like, especially if you're somebody, wait, es oh. especially if you're somebody who, you know, is just kind of used to doing, like, the same thing over and over again. Yeah. I think it's, you know, a very important thing for you to kind of, you know, just jump out the box. Because even doing this is already, like, a little bit, I mean, I don't post videos of myself on no platform, no social media platform. I don't have an Instagram. This guy's even have a, you got a Twitter. And you know, he retweets. He tweets like everything. He doesn't even like tweet himself barely. Do you tweet ever? No, right? Yeah, you once do? in a while. Once in a while. Like, but, but, once a year. Yeah. Cause I get like I get notifications on my phone like from like active oh, people. Oh, he gets like, notifications. He I, I don't even know why. Oh, oh he has alerts. He has the alerts on. Oh, oh. <laughs> no, 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 look at him. He's blushing. He's blushing. Look at this guy. So, he's real for real. So <laughs> <laughs> look at him. He's not too fucking. <laughs> I'm not standing behind these allegations. <laughs> I feel flattered. It's getting a little hot in here. Isn't I'm not allowed to think on that. No, you're not trying to find out because I don't want to blow the speakers out this thing. That's the only reason. Oh, man. Yeah, man. Yo, I just noticed how loud we are. You know, we have that volume meter, yeah. and that thing is off the roof. Honestly, man, look, either, is, this is going to go one or two ways. Anyways, wait, either this is about to die, or how, how are we doing here? Come, wow, come down, big come down, come down. <laughs> it's not coming down. It's alright. Right. I'm gonna edit that out. I want that. I want that live. Just you doing this. <laughs> I'm gonna stay there. We'll, stay. we'll keep it there. Right. So, where was I going, man? You always make me lose my train. Of Yo, thought. you were the one blushing and trying to like, you know, get you my number over here. You make me lose my train of thought now. Hey, look at okay. Me, uh, um, sorry. <laughs> uh -huh. You were talking about him not having Instagram. Oh right, right, right. So, like so video. yeah, so doing this for both of us is a new thing, right? Because we, I've never posted a video up on YouTube myself and whatnot. Yeah. So I mean, this is so basically, this is just our version of doing it, just doing it, right? Not contemplating, mm -hmm. not thinking, just let's just go with it, you know. And we learn as we go, you know. Yeah. Like, we're gonna make mistakes. I'm pretty sure that five episodes, ten episodes, fifteen episodes, that will be a lot better than this one. And, you know, I hope just, we're better. Yeah. That's, that, the idea is you get better. Yes. If you're not getting better. Then you should examine yourself and wonder definitely, what's going on. Definitely, definitely. You have to do it in every yeah, aspect, yeah, yeah, for sure. Every... I mean, if you're starting at zero, there's only one way to go. Yeah. And it's up. And it's up, yeah. <laughs> you stay in there, or you going negative, uh, no problem. <laughs> no, no problem. Right. Maybe that's not for you. Yeah, 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 we, we gotta kind of move on. on. Yes. But you know, that, that's very important, though. Like, it's, it's tasting. You know, you have to, like, really just just do, man. Like, yo, you if you've always wanted to start a blog, just start a blog, man. A hundred bugs, go to, you know, um, anywix.com and, you know, start your little blog little and website, start typing. Yeah, yeah. yeah build right, your little right. website for a hundred bucks or whatnot. And just start typing, promote your stuff, man. We just live in a world that's very different from the world that our parents lived in. Oh, definitely. Definitely, you know, like, huge gaps. I mean, like, we just, 
just two young people in our 20s, like he said, trying to give value to other people, whoever you are, whether you're 30 years old, 50 years old, our age, younger, you Doesn't can matter. get value yeah. from, you know, anything we have to say. Because at the end of the day, you know, our form of conversation isn't always like the most serious conversation, but we do have serious conversations, yeah. right? But we also like, you know, we like and to have fun yeah. with it and you know what I mean? Like, really and, and I, I think you don't need to have a serious tone to have a serious conversation. Absolutely not. Right, because yeah. you can get the right message or, or an, uh, I guess, an important point across and still laugh, you know. For sure. I, honestly, I, I know for a fact that none of us are serious guys. So <laughs> if sure. this is never going to be yeah. serious and if you're expecting something serious, then you're out of luck. Yeah, you're out of luck. Yeah, yeah, it's yeah, like yeah. just two guys that are really just trying to be us, yeah. you know, trying to bring value like you were saying. Sure. And, and, you know, we are trying to practice what we're preaching. So, you know, the whole just do it, the whole I'm down, it's us saying, you know, we don't want to be close minded We don't want to be, because uh, nothing in the world is black and white. If you think that that's the truth, then you're also missing out on that. You know, most of our life is going to live in the gray. You know, it's like, I'm not certain about this, I'm not certain about that, but I'm willing to try it out. Definitely. I'm willing to grow, Definitely. you know. And no loss is a loss if you can get a lesson out of it. Right? That's deep. So, that's deep. That's deep. Power to the yeah, people. Yeah, definitely. You can, I, I don't think you can do that. I don't think you can Power do that. Power to the people. Power to the people. We're not Power to the people. I got you. I got you. Wakanda forever. No, no, no. Definitely not doing that. Okay. But no, no, all right. But you know what? That was that was very deep. Though. And you're actually absolutely right. You know, you know one of the, one of the bigger things is that people don't try things because you're scared to lose or you're scared to fail, yeah, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And... Once you get into the mentality that there's no such thing as losing, is either you win well, there, or there, you there, learn. Losing. You win or learn. No, no, no. The Russell Westbrook lost yesterday. <laughs> there is no way to learn. Russell Westbrook learned yesterday. No, okay? he was. You know, I didn't watch the game. You know, you know what he learned, right? He learned that his teammates suck. <laughs> so he learned. You know, the only thing I saw from that was um, that some guy was selling him some crap and he like got him kicked out or something. I don't know if you saw that. It's yeah, just, man, he almost knocked down a guy's yeah, phone. Yeah, I saw like some guy was like talking crap. I don't know. But he's still the like, best player in the NBA. By far, best player in the NBA. That's opinionated. I do not sound behind those allegations. <laughs> why is my phone ringing? I'm well, why, why do you have a phone from the 90s? You know what's funny? I think I'm probably one of the only people I know that has a landline still. <laughs> a landline. Everybody has their cell phone. I have a landline. Comcast came into his house. That's hey, can crazy. we upgrade? <laughs> That's crazy to me, man. Comcast has told you, hey, we don't have no more of this. Look, yeah, man. I, I got some access to this stuff, though, bro. You know what I'm saying? They, Com they Comcast mean, offered him an iPhone. <laughs> That's how bad they felt for his him. His phones are good. I can prank call y'all. You know what I'm saying? Do all kinds of crazy. You know you bored at night. You got to do something. Prank call somebody. You know, what are you going to do? What are you going to do at night? It's 12 at night. What are you going to do? Netflix. Like a normal person. Netflix? <laughs> when he's like, you're gonna prank up you, Star 67. So everybody, this guy's dirty. He wants to Netflix and chill by himself at 12 o'clock. Do you, do, you, do you peep that? No, don't take a I didn't say chill. First of all, it was Dill. I want to repeat this. First was Dill, now it's Netflix. Something wrong with you, bro. You look sick today. Sir, we're gonna have for a moment. Guys, we're gonna take us a moment to pray for this little man right now. We have light hands. He needs some deliverance. This guy is messed up. No, but on the serious note, I actually forgot what we were saying. Try it. Well, okay, let me put this back on track, right? So at the end at the end to kinda like wrap this up a little bit more, yeah. you know, like he said, we kinda wanna be an example to what we're preaching, right? Practice what we yeah. preach. And you know, hopefully we can have you know, a lot more people on this guest and whatnot. So, cause you know, at the end of the day, it's important for us, the youth, to have conversations anyway. You get me? That's that. And that he was just telling me that right before we were, started recording, right? I, you probably said it during the conversation too, right? We yeah. Recording. Yeah. It's important to have conversation. Like conversation is important, especially with us youth. You get me? Like, you know, you could, you know, like, you know we talk about the game and whatnot. And the, you know, like, all that stuff is cool, but it's also important to have real conversations. You get me? About not just your goals in your life, but what's practical. You know what I'm saying? What you can do. Because there's a thing Together, like, yeah. you know, we can tell you, all, oh, you know, work hard and do this. and you know, but there, there's not one track for anybody. You get me? No, there's and, and also, tracks. like, uh, many of those things sound like fortune cookies. They do. Like, have you ever heard, like, you know, you're like, you're going to have a great day today. Mm -hmm. But if like yesterday was the worst day you've ever had, any day is better. Yeah, you get yeah. it. So many of us will say things like, "Hey, work hard," or "Dedicate yourself," or "Be passionate." But it's like, you know, where's the practical on this? Like, what does work hard look like to you? You know, maybe to yes. you, maybe to us. Literally, to us, work hard look like this. We went to Amazon. We, this guy spent I don't know how many hours of reviews just looking at programs and whatnot. Yeah. You know, it's like, hey, what well, audio? We, we, we're using a what? Dead rat mouse? The, uh, dead, dead, cat, dead cat? Mike? Mike? Mike little what, fluffy it, thing yeah. on the mic. And we, I, I, I didn't even know that existed till now. You know, but it's just saying, hey, 
this is the dream, this is the vision. So I'm gonna take that first step, and then one after, after the first step, you take the second step, and then the third step, and then you maybe you stumble, but you get back up into the fourth step, and then when you look back, it's like oh snap, you know this this vision is coming into a reality. Yeah. But I think, and and I will go back to to bring it back to this full circle. As young people, we are too be too busy dreaming. Yes. Oh, yeah, man. Because Bro, yes. you know, honestly, I think we all want good stuff. Right, and that's not nothing wrong with the good stuff. It's just that since it's not an Amazon Prime, we can't, we can't, we can't get it. We can't get it. Yeah, no, that's that's two day delivery. Whoever didn't get that metaphor, you're asleep right now. I'm gonna tell you that right now. That was a good metaphor. First of all, if you, you don't have, get it? if you don't have Amazon Prime, you sleep. Amazon, you should sponsor us. I'm tired of paying for my account. I ain't gonna lie, me too, man. <laughs> I only pay once a year though. Yeah, me too. Obviously. It's like $100. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, a lot of y'all be yeah, me off guard with those $100. Yeah, I'm like, copy <laughs> <on> $98. <laughs> you forget. And then yeah, you're like, my copy be like a $98. It's like, <laughs> hold up. Hold up, Amazon. No, no, no. Refund right now, bro. <laughs> Payment for that. Payment for Yes, yes, man. Yeah, but, but that, that was deep though. It's absolutely right. We all want it like this, like this, you know, but. And, and the struggle for us, I think it's going to be a same struggle for you guys, is we're going to try to make it one episode at a time. You know, I don't know if this is gonna last a couple months or a couple years. I don't know if it's gonna blow up or blow down. Down. I don't know. I don't know if that's the way it's like. Cause it's blow up or blow up. You hear me? Well, yeah, true. Yeah, true. Cause this is it. Well, it's well, I like, yeah. blow up or blow up. Yeah. 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 The idea is still, hey, we're gonna endure. We're gonna see it through, mm-hmm. right? Because at the end of the day, the first people who are gonna be benefited from this is us. Because whether it fails or whether it works, at least we try. Amen. Yep. And I think that's the way we're gonna approach our lives, right? Yeah, it's, it's we're down. We're down to live our lives. We don't wanna, you know, look back and say, yo, we missed out on this experience or that experience. Yeah, yeah. But rather is we learned, we yeah. loved, we lost. Yeah, sure. I also the cookie cutting and stuff though. <laughs> that's no, but, cliche. I mean, it's, but it's, it's, true. it's true. It's true. true. It's true. Look, and at the end of the day, what we're doing is we're not creating content right now, right? We're literally documenting. You get me? Right, like we're yeah, because yeah, these conversations are the conversations we have anyways. You get me? Like we're gonna have those conversations regardless. You yeah, know that's what I mean? true. That's true. It's just yeah, it's just that, you know, through these platforms we can reach a larger audience. So it's almost like speaking to like a bigger group of friends. You yeah. get me? Like a big just like you know more people you reach more and, people. And that's what we want, right? Yeah. We just want to bring people in and, and want to hear from you like we were saying mm-hmm. and we want you know you guys to hear from us and yeah. maybe you know have the back and forth co- back and forth conversation just to to see the points that we maybe we miss. Yes. Because you and I, we've grown together. Yeah. So some things are very different, but some things we think are like. Yeah. So we might need an outlook for somebody else. Yeah, yeah. very true. So I, I think that's what this is going to be like. I'm down to just listen to somebody else. Do it. Yeah. So whether you like it, dislike it, hate it, or love it, we just want to hear from people. Yeah, man. Yep. That's, that's, that's what it is, people. So, um... I think we wrap it up there. Yeah, man. Yeah, we actually talked about that. 30 yeah. minutes right there. That's pretty good. So that's the first... Uh-huh episode the first episode of i'm down so thank y'all for tuning in um we're gonna have our social medias you know real real quick well you can follow me right now at least right now j x r g e g v t i that's gonna be that's basically george goody but my way so don't judge me right now <laughs> i might george change goody? it yeah that's george, not your last name well it's goody no it's, it's not, not goody it's gutierrez zeta, yes zeta, zeta. gutierrez <laughs> okay and uh, follow Chris. What can follow you? Where? Oh, uh, you can follow my Twitter, which I don't even remember my Twitter to be honest. Your but Twitter? we'll add it to the. I list. think I know. It's Christoph something, right? What is it? I don't know. I think it's like Christian. No, it's not. Seven four six nine two. Nah. Yeah. Is it Christian? Why is it Christian? Because there's no H. Okay. Well, that's horrible. <laughs> Well, that's my fault. My parents wrote it that way. You know, when they try to give you those creative true. names, true, true. it's like there's nothing creative about their age. It doesn't sound anyways. Gotcha, gotcha. True, but, true. Um, well, yeah, so, you know what? Yeah, I like I like the idea. Um, the, the girl in the background just gave us the idea. Um, <laughs> so, we'll just leave, you know, uh, so the down details, in the description yeah. for, the, for the video people, for the people in the podcast world. You know, um, we're going to be having an Instagram channel for I'm Down very soon. Yep. You know, to try to get that going on. We're going to try to uh, blow up a website for it too to make it easier for people to just go on. <sighs> You know, links, all that good stuff. So that, that should be coming uh, very, very soon. We'll be in the works for that. And um, yeah, thank you for tuning in. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Hope you guys enjoyed it. If you guys did it, we'd love to hear from you anyways. Mm-hmm. Uh, we love everything, right? Yeah, hey, yeah. comments, whatever. Whatever, man. You I, I don't love you yet. I, I haven't met you. We're more like in a dating stage, you know? Yeah, yeah. So like, uh, we took you to dinner. Now you come back and you talk to us. So cool. Yeah. This is Peace.